Hello, anyone in there watching now or later? Helen here along with... Akir, the Mad Swede. And welcome back to Let's Train Darksiders 2. And yeah, I, I looked into things a bit more with the Shadows problem, but apparently that is just a, an engine problem. So, this is the uh, tale thus far. Yeah, there's little that the can be done about that. Dry, but the horsemen loosed its waters. And then the makers rejoiced, for their forge burned anew. From its fires they made a key, one which could awaken stone. <laughs> it's always nice when games have little recap bits like that, but yeah. The shadows, that's, that's an issue that I can't do anything about really. Except for one thing that was advised to not have it at the highest quality for some reason. And to have vertical sync on. We'll see if that does um, anything, if at all. Oh, uh, yeah. Last time we entered the Lost Temple. So, and well, I'm pretty sure that ahead of us looks like a boss arena. So, yeah. we'll see what happens. They're not even a boss arena, an actual arena! Yeah, because we still need to find a way to get past the giant corruption beast blocking the way to the, the world tree. Thought so. Construct Hulk at Marvel Gun Sue. <laughs> I don't think we can for. Yeah, Hulk, Hulk, Hulk is too uh, common a word for just big things. Yeah, I don't know what the actual meaning of Hulk is. There's another one coming. Okay. We're going to have to get up close with this thing, but probably not too close. I'm just, I'm just going to straight up use one of our healing bits. Yeah, and I think I just have that big comical idea. Do you remember your face weapon? Yeah. You and him have basically a similar weapon at the moment. Yeah, then again, he has more drill since the orb fists out. Hello. Okay, that's how we're going to be dealing a lot of damage then, because we hardly did any. Oh. Hello. Uh, I was too looking forward for you to have a boxing match. Boxing match with him. There we go. Oh, okay, that disables. Oh, this is what we need to hit. Oh. Okay, one at a time, boys. Okay, that did a good amount of damage. Oop. And he's coming in to do a bunch of his own. Hello there. Okay, whenever he does that, one of these bombs is going to drop down for us to grab. Okay, I can't really tell if they're the volatile... They look like the volatile ones. Ah, yeah, if every time he does it, they also get set off. And where the hell did that loan land on it? I think when he hit for upper five. Yeah, they prematurely explode every time he does that. There we go. Okay. Gets us a little posse. We have a moment of vulnerability. Okay, that's no good to note. on the big one. Yeah. Yeah, that, that 
that power is going to be very useful for dealing with the ants. Is he going to do it again? Yes, I think that's how he's been getting me hit with when they blow up. Immediately as I pick it up. Did I shoot that one before it even landed? I'm not even sure. What are you doing? Uh, that's the quick draw. Uh, ow, that's close. We can't really jump when we're carrying something, it seems. And we can only duck out dodge so many times before death gets tired and... Okay, that didn't leave any down. Okay. It left one down. Are they exploding before they even land now? Okay, there's a bunch of them. Like, shaking down a... a what is even the word? A, a bunch of bananas. Ow. Okay, that also explains that they get... They, <laughs> their timer starts the moment they land. I think the explosive has now dealt more damage to me than he. Healing. We're going to need a lot of those <laughs> potions for this game, I think. Whoa! A blueberry! I think he said it off himself this time. <laughs> hey, come on, can we finish? Yeah, Death doesn't fuck around with his executions, huh? Let's see. Skeletal acts are rending. The tale often told among the dead planes concerns a proud warrior who boasted often of his skills, only for it to be later revealed that the braggart had claimed the victories of others for his own. As punishment, the warrior was transformed into a magical axe, doomed forever to assist others in gaining the glory he had so wrongfully sought. Although this axe does not strike as hard as many other weapons, it steals the vitality of those it strikes and transfers it to the wielder, strengthening him while uh, weakening his foes. Critical strikes with the axe rend the foe for even greater amounts of stone and health. That sounds useful. Yeah, and that's interesting lore about it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's familiar. We had to deal with these big boys quite a bit in Dark Shadows 1. And also some loot up here. And another mace, a club. A club would be better. <laughs> a mace would be a lot shorter. And some new boots. So let's take a look. Just have one hand or two hand maze. Yeah, I I forgot to look up something. Hmm? Uh, with some of these, with this weapon at the time, if the twelve piercing damage adds up on the rest, would may mean that it deals more damage than the others. But when you when I swap over the 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 stats on the right side, it shows that a weapon with well. With more, to with more of just outright damage, but no piercing damage or extra damage, it has a higher DPS than it. So I'm thinking the 12 piercing damage might mean that 12 of the damage is that in that piercing damage. But I forgot to look that up. That, that, that might be it. it. It's still a good thing, but it means 
The least of extra amount is being pissed through a armored foe. Uh, if that is even what the piercing in this game means. If, again, I've, I keep pressing the wrong freaking button with that. Let's see. Fro that's... Okay, that's only frost damage that that one deals. We've got the glaive here. Might as well take a look to see it. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's a... <laughs> that's a blade. A glaive with a mace as a pummel. And then we have the skeletal axe of rending. Oh! The head of it looks more like a freaking warhammer of sorts. <laughs> yeah, let's let's try this thing out for a bit. And here we have less yeah, armor, have more gold. Yeah, we should try this out. We, we should try this axe and that hammer out a little bit. Okay, we'll probably do a lot more area damage. And the... Uh, right there. The uh, pistons and such would deal a lot more single target damage. say that you can reach the foundry and that a guardian lies within the foundry here yeah. it is where i was cast but it was lost and now you will need my help corruption spreads across your realm and you slumber stone is heavy it is easier to rest in my dreams, I can move again. In my dreams, I am flesh. Huh? This place, what was it? I cannot tell you. It's on the tip of my tongue, but my tongue seems to be elsewhere. Will you help me, uh, old one? Yes. Shall we? Hold on, little one. In my slumber, I have felt the guardian reaching to my dream. The strongest of us all, but in his heart there is a hunger. The Guardian was built to destroy. He has much in common with corruption. You must speak with Adar and make your peace before we cross over. There may be no crossing back. Okay, so now we know that all those golems that uh, war is having to deal with right now were made by the makers. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 yeah go ahead. What? I would say that may explain why the demons treated them as shit and were shading them and all that. Yeah. Uh, let's see, I can just go up here. Or can I? Oh, there's no grabbable ledge. Okay. Um, really, they want us to jump into the water, but okay, that, that does bring us to this thing. Okay. We'll need to find Volgrim or wherever he is hiding. 
But uh, yeah, I guess no. that also gives a bit of an answer of uh, sort of do do robots dream of electric sheep, but with yeah golems. Well, he he did say in his dreams it was made of flesh. Yeah. So the answer is no. <laughs> they dream of sheep. Yeah. Uh, let's go see about getting that trinket then. Let's not get in between that. <laughs> Let him deal with his own anger issues. Oh. I restored your forge and brought life to stone. But am I any closer to the tree? Tell me now, old one, or you may never get the chance. I hear the foundry is dangerous. As is the tree, horseman, and the entire forest. That is why you must awaken the Guardian. But have you asked yourself why you seek the tree? The tree of life is where I will find my brother's absolution. The tree of life is a gateway. From it, one may travel to places undreamed of, whether a world of oceans and forests, or ice, or endless night. The tree exists there. It may appear different, yet it is the same tree and its roots connect all the realms. The tree of life is not where journeys end, but where they begin. Achievements to move a mountain. And uh, yeah, we <laughs> anyone with some knowledge of uh, Nordic would, would it be Nordic? Nordic mythology would basically have figured out already that the Tree of Life is pretty much Yggdrasil, or the world yep, tree. Um, you could say Nordic, or you could say Germanic as well. So, yeah, Germany, a whole Netherlands, did have the same uh, faith as the Norse. Just, yeah, the Norse were pretty obvious in the last ones to revere it. Yeah. Something true. Here is what you asked for. Ah, thank you, horseman. You'll not be sorry for your trouble. This talisman will certainly help you on your quest. But I fear you will not break your destiny. No, but I believe I might bend it a little. <laughs> okay, that's one way there to see it. There are new talismans for you to browse. Let's see. Let's get rid of My our stuff. We're keeping we're keeping the special ones, and we're, we're keeping the gondolas of frost just in case. I will offer this to the forest. And let's see. That one has less use now, but for savings, it's I not even that useful as or not that pricey. So we can just keep it around. I will offer these. Actually, that one has more defense, so we'd have to see what it. I will make you. Yeah, you will make us what? <laughs> Let's see. Special ability Grin. Hmm. Critical damage. Would be more useful if we had a more critical hit weapon. And we're not selling health potions. We are, however. Let's see, how much do we have? 60,000! That's a good, it gets a good amount. Let's get a few of these. It is not to be. Let's see, how are any of these? I don't think I've really seen too many games where it's worthwhile to sell health potions. I mean, except you know, have many health potions that are not worth using, that are so too weak. Let's see, health on executes. 41 defense. I think defense is in general going to be our most useful thing that we can buy stuff for. But we, we need to keep in mind that we, so far we've found better stuff every time we've bought something <laughs> rather quickly. Yeah. Let's see. Grim Talisman. A, ma a maker known only as the Mad Smith forged this talisman using the arms and armor of slain warriors from the Dead Plains. Grim, as the talisman was named, was crafted to distill and concentrate necromantic power from the Abyss. The Grim Talisman makes any weapon wielded by its owner build Reaper energy with every successful attack. Okay. 
So it'll allow us to use Reaper for more often. Alright. So it is kinda it is good in a way. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what where can we see uh, here? Okay, it doesn't say it doesn't specifically say what the ability is, but I'm guessing yeah, the, the lore says it all basically. Hmm. I'll, I'll check over here what they have for sale at the moment. And if they have something that gives a big boost, we might get that. Yeah, never mind. They're still inside, <laughs> hammering away whilst they still can, of course. <laughs> I probably should have looked first. I used to say, if you're right back, they don't die. And you kill yourself before I can say it. <sighs> okay. Yeah. She was selling amulets that give 40 defense. That is. A lot compared to what, uh, a lot with what we have at the moment. That yeah, that would basically add like a fifth or a fourth of our, uh, yeah, a fifth of the defense that we have at the moment. Hmm? Yeah. When did you get here? Worry not, Maker. Now you can find your way home. This compass guided me to many wonders. To hold it again after so long. It makes me feel a mere 500 years old. Thank you. Gauntlets of savagery. And it, this was literally just around the corner. <laughs> Using the very bones of the demon he defeated, an unknown maker craftsman forged these weapons to celebrate his victory in battle. The wearer of these gauntlets is imbued with the demonic feral, uh, demon's feral energy. The more damage is done to the wielder, the more frenzied and savage his attacks become. Okay, so lower health means more <clears throat> more attack power. It's a okay. Bit. Yeah, they would deal more damage. Special ability blood loss. It would be nice to have, a, yeah, a better description of the ability specifically. Did you see them? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I, I do gotta say that the art team for this game did a wonderful job. Yeah, they... They did it very much. Oh, browser out. We have new items. Let's see. More info. Oh, oh, even the normal weapons have a bit of stuff you can see. Or not. It's all the same. Let's see. I very much doubt that they'd have a better... Okay, I stand corrected. That might be better, but... Hmm. Let's see. Anything better on armor here? That is... That that is equal. 61 defense on that. And a lot of strength as well. Let's see. That has... 25 thorns. Then it doesn't. Uh, yeah, it doesn't explain what that is, but basically, typically in thorns in games means that if you get hit, the enemy gets damaged in turn. Hmm. We'll have to see how much we have, how much defense our current pants have. No better there. So the one. Okay. 61 on the torso piece. Okay, that, that's only an upgrade of 6. So, yeah, not really worth it. It's Mulder. Would that mean that Dawn of the Sergey would work well with a armor set with forms? Hmm. Maybe. Now, first off, though, are there any other side quests we can do here? Yes. Okay, that's that's to the <laughs> the tree. We'll be heading there soon enough. But there shouldn't be any more side quests at the moment. This thing was the <gasps> error of all of those. 
And I almost fell back down again. Well, fell <laughs> to a death again. All right, then, big boy. Oh, he's going to he's going to fastball special us, isn't he? So the time has come. What became of the other wardens? In my dreams, I felt many of my brothers, but only one still called. A warden whose ancient soul still haunts me, though his stone is lost. Tell me about the foundry. It is a holy site where soul is fused with stone. It doesn't look so holy from here. The darkness. A spare little in our realm. But the foundry is a place of magic. It is strong. And with your help, we will claim it once more. The warden. It's not safe to go alone. You need my help. Okay, I hadn't expected that. And I was half expecting him to say, take this and offer his hammer. <laughs> okay, thing. Why are you sticking around then? Oh, well, it's an easy guess why he's, he's sticking around here. Uh, he screwed up uh, before and wants to make it right by helping us instead. Yeah, makes sense. Nothing hidden here. For a place cleaned by corruption, it seems pretty clean so far. And again, I didn't look up much. following right behind us. Let's see. I don't remember anything about this dungeon. Nope. Nope. Okay. Yeah, it, it is called the Foundry, so it be... shouldn't be surprised that it also works as a Foundry. <laughs> That is a big ass hammer. Not yet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah they say minutes. everything is. They say everything is bigger in America. I think we. I think uh, the makers have them beat on that as well. Yeah. By a massive bobo. Yeah. Do some of this that hammer is supposed to be higher up? Looks like crash down. Yeah, let's get yeah, there. Well, how about it then? Okay, so we're uh -oh. still going to get thrown. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It, yeah, it does look like it's off balance. Let's see. I can see three. There's four chains attached to it, but they're all attached to the wall still, so maybe it's meant to lean? Which, uh, personally, I wouldn't be feels very safe standing where Thane is right now with that thing looming over.
narrative about that that explains where we need to jump because the the cauldrons have repair work done to them that we need to stick to. Where do we go from here? <gasps> there. Because we don't want to get showered by lava. I uh, don't think that's lava. It, very, it looks uh, very hot, to say the very least. Yeah, but what I mean is... It might be molten metal. Good chance as well. Either way, we don't want to touch it. Oh, hello there. Indeed. And hello. And once more. Once more, I got the controls wrong for a second. Because I had to swap my hands from exploration mode to combat mode. Now they're level 10. Hmm. Oh, I can still get there. From what I thought, I'd miss this one because I jumped off on the wrong side. Okay, there was something new with that. Let's see. Arm blades. Ice damage. Hmm. Wrong button again. And we also got a fierce maze. Let, let's equip these just to see how they look. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, how does that do ice damage? It looks like they're glow with fire. Oh no. Look at this frozen pit. <laughs> and we already have those. What? Yeah, the, the knuckle things that we had earlier. You knuckles have frozen piss! Uh, me thinks you forgot me. <laughs> <laughs> off me off the horrid! <laughs> I'll get the door. Let her drop. Okay, I think that shows how strong these makers are, I even more in the forge. Old Wallace could manage this for days. How how even the youngest of them is massively strong. <laughs> I know I made this look easy, but do you mind hurrying it up a bit? <laughs> well, what have we here? That's the Guardian Rider. And if you would get to the tree, we will have to wake that beast. The Guardian will do what it was made to. Destroy the corruption blocking the tree. But it looks finished. Why does it just stand there? The body is finished, aye. But as it stands, it is no more than dead stone. To give life to the stone, we must give it the essence of a maker's heart. Three of them for a beast this large. And how do we do that? These heart stones were finished along with the Guardian. But never married to the stone. They're all in the temple. We need only look to find them. Then let's go. I do got a question. What? How specifically they are with essence of the heart? Like uh, infused with blood or something, and something is crashing down. Go. Oh. Or if they mean uh, a full-on maker's heart. They say they use a fragment of it. Is it over already? <laughs> Don't be too eager or you'll get yourself stuck. <laughs> hmm. 
Let's see, have we gone? No, we've not gone this way, so we might as well take a look. Wait, okay. it could just be more figurative speeds. Have to launch that one up there. <laughs> okay. That's it. Yeah, he's quite capable in combat as well. Well, with a hammer that big, it'd be pretty easy if you can swing it around with ease. Yeah. I think he be able to have a demon just well by us. One smash and they would not get up. Hmm. Okay. Can we smash this? We haven't had to That's deal it. with it. Yep. Oh, well, <laughs> this works as well. We'll have to keep an eye out for places where he can throw us over. This will give just some bullets. Nothing too interesting. Now, what have we down here? Some more stuff to break, but also cool. Let's see? We're going to need a ball around here somewhere. Okay, here we have them. I doubt that we can activate them. Yeah, we, we can't activate them on the water, so we need to raise this platform somehow. Okay. This is probably somewhere new. I can't be surprised. Hmm? That is not very much. Okay, here's the ball, but the gate's Wait. closed. Yeah, we only seen for him once. Yeah. He was a lot more active with uh, war. But then again, he, war kind of needed him for fast traveling around. We, he, we can just do it on our own. Hmm. I see smooth stone. Yep. Okay, now we have to deal with one-way doors. <gasps> and I see that there's an area here as well. Yep. Okay, will you hide what we need to move on? Stone, so up. Okay. Like, I'm pretty sure with any, <laughs> well, basically anything yes, other than a maker, uh, they'd get instantly squashed with that thing. Yeah. <laughs> like not, not even a, not even a moment of resistance. Uh, from one second to the other, yeah, from one second to the other, you're a uh, catch up. Line this up. Okay, come on. Third time to charm. Nope. Okay, I, I just need to head towards it. So it is lined up completely. That's a good... No. Come on. That one. There we go. Whoa. This is coming up. And we've got our going. This we can start smashing the place off. And 
blew through Kane for the smashing. Okay, we probably should be careful though because Thane is vulnerable to corruption. So there's probably a good chance that he could die to these beasts. And again, he seems to be pretty good at smashing them all the same anyways. I don't think you can throw me and this thing at the same time, Thane. New chest piece. Good chance. Good chance says that it's better than the stuff we could have bought. It's actually not. It's actually absolutely terrible. Okay. Who <laughs> The new sites at plus 10 execution chance, but lower damage. Hmm. Mm. And so far, we have been cutting through enemies pretty quickly enough. We don't. I don't think we get any special bonuses at the moment for executions, other than just quickly killing an enemy. We're killing them quickly enough as is. Hmm. So if we had, oh, if we had gotten that talisman, that uh, <clears throat> would give us health on executions, then it would be more useful. Yeah. Now though, find the clear path. Okay. Anything dumb enough to come at us here? Yeah, but I didn't realize. Did he signal that he could throw you somewhere? Yeah, but it was probably to get up in that place. Uh, not sure what he's talking about. But yeah, I'm, I think he meant the place that he, he threw us up to earlier. Possibly. Get some sort of whip, we could probably go for that, but let's not. So instead, we go here. So we, yeah, we don't have some sort of grapple ability at the moment. And, yeah. These two blend into the background for a bit for me. And what are those two up to? For a moment, I thought it looks, it's like they're trying to open the chest. That, that chest on the minimap is underneath us. Bad timing. <laughs> uh. Yeah, th this gameplay is reminding me a lot of the Prince of Persia games. And yes, I do, I do have... No, wrong way, Beth. And okay, I was pretty sure if, no, if I'd gone there, it would have smacked me anyways. But I do have the Prince of Persia games on the uh, to-do list for streaming eventually. Okay, nothing special. More of these clowns. And level. Oh, missed me.
these they're blades with the crystals embedded in them it reminds me a bit of those uh, obsidian shard swords that the Aztec would use. Mm. Uh, and it's another well, champion. See? Time for some reinforcements. Or distractions. Well, those last are pretty long, huh? <laughs> okay, I can keep the combo going. For oh, hello. <laughs> yeah, making sure it's good and dead, huh? Oh yeah, I, I, I can keep you can keep the combo going for quite a bit by alternating between the the sites and the secondary. Why is it that my nose has been starting to itch more often these days? Could be the, yeah, because yeah, it could be because the temperature is falling. And what is this? Uh, a key, of course. Okay. Let's not fall off of it. <laughs> yeah, I, we're going to need something to be able to use that thing, because we haven't we haven't encountered those grappling points yet. So I, we'll probably get something. For that later. For now, though, let's actually bring this thing along. Because, yeah, it's just so it's so freaking useful for smashing things up. Okay, tiny, follow along. Looks a lot like uh, Eduard or some the, the elder. And again, a lot of elders of this pit are going to look alike after a certain point. Yeah, yeah. That's all, you know, all you hear you say that thing. She'd probably turn you into a new weapon. Oh, well, those were dealt with easy. And again, we are on the way. We are on the easy difficulty, and these are familiar, huh? Yeah, they are. Achievement, uh, achievement, the Spectral Touch. Death Grip. With the Death Grip ability, Death can grasp certain uh, targets from a long distance. He uses this to its advantage by either pulling himself to larger targets or bringing smaller objects to him. So it, it's, a, it's a grappling hook, only magic and death teams uh, beam with. I like the little electric system. We can go grab that now, yeah? There's also one here. I cannot. Go. Oh, we're full on health potions, so yeah, we'll. Okay, we can only carry five at a time. Okay, we'll have to be careful with using too many of them then. 
And there, the <laughs> dungeon map. Okay. I don't think we want to jump down there. So yes, it's off of the map. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, how do we get up there? Because we, you know, we can't reach the wall high, at a high enough point to get up there. Hmm. Let's see. Okay, we can use those now. Always nice when things light up, but I'm not seeing anything similar here. And again, there's a platform there. Can we get on top of that? There's no way we're getting nearer to it without <laughs> a very sudden drop and a very sudden stop at the end. Hello. Wait. Uh, that does not give us access. Hmm. New hammer. Hmm. What is hidden up there then? Or anything at all? We don't. We don't have the compass, so we can't see on the map. Actually. There is something there. There is some. That, that, that looks like the glow of one of those uh, tokens that Voldrum wants. So. Not, no idea how we should be able to get there. Because we need some sort of double jump to get up high enough on the wall to reach that place. Oh. And I'm not sure if we even get a double jump. We can go get that, oh, that other chest. Yeah. Oh. And some uh, stupid constructs are stupid enough to come at us. Anyone else? Nobody else. And where are, are you going there, thing? On the boat! Roll on! Okay, we'll we'll see what he's up to after we get his chest. Yeah, and yes, people, I made that low hanging fruit. Someone has made that a, a transformer young kill. Okay. Uh, hmm. Can I? Okay, you don't need to aim it. And was that a purple? Ross per kill. Let's take that. Okay, those look pretty fancy. Great. Per that is. I think mean, those are major size. Let's see. Purple and gold often go well, Tech. Uh, Dest, you might be uh, poking yourself in the back of the shoulder. Ow! Let's see. Lots of damage, but. We have no real need for anything. Critical damage. More armor, so we'll take those. More defense. And more experience. And nothing much else will use. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> At the very least, it pushes us back here. That was a nice right. one. You keep everything? Yeah, you, you keep everything. Alright. Yeah. Okay, I, I might have jumped a bit too early there then, but okay. What the heck were you going to show us, Thane? Follow me! Okay. Uh, you're the one following me now. Follow me! Make it choice, Baldy. Follow me! Now he's going. Follow me. Or not. <laughs> Let's 
park you assigned. Well, <laughs> I don't think people care much about giving parking tickets at the moment. You what? I will, give, I will give you one now. Uh, yes. Too many of them. Yeah, that's it. There we go. Yeah, you have to use some some hardy metals to which is have them stick into molten lava. Okay. Yeah, but well, it is not lava, but the molten metal itself. So. Uh, I think it is uh, mag. It, I think it is lava slash magma. I because they, they, they wouldn't have much. They wouldn't have much need for having the metal flow outside of stuff. I think this is a case of. Uh, uh, here's the thing: the way it flows is not how lava flows. Again, it, it hardly ever does how it flows in reality. Are you going to throw yeah, me? This nope. is more of a move around like a molten metal. And I wouldn't be surprised that the reason there's metal around here is, well, someone broke something around here. See? Ah, there we go. Supposed to be walking in here. Mm. There we go. And here we are for the other one. Which we totally couldn't just jump it out with a running start. Oh, me, we might have, but uh, we don't really know of the uh, athletic abilities of makers, do we? Yeah, we see them fight them all, but have we ever really seen them young? Nope. Well, sure, they may be seen one jump from a building, but more jumping down, not jumping across. Yeah, I think in, in that regard they probably still are somewhat like warp still. In the yeah, <laughs> they need they need to get thrown themselves to cover a large vertical distances. Oh, you are going to need a very big Lego loss to throw this Gimli. Yeah, and. It, it depends on the law of game and groups and stuff for if you go by warm and wars, they can young. And especially the slayer dwarfs. Ah, a heartstone. Within lays the soul of a great maker. Find a way to bring it down, and I'll carry it. Ah, I've thrown stones bigger than you. Okay, so that basically confirms it then, that it does require, uh, yeah, the death of a maker. Yeah, no, I suspect that don't kill the makers, I don't know how they to behave. I suspect they, like, if you have a maker that is dying, they may, maybe they won't want to kill. Yeah. What's a good idea? Uh, what was it called? Organ donor! Might be something similar to organ donor. Yeah, or a, 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 a rather literal permanent retirement. Yeah. And they only use a fragment of it to uh, uh, normally awaken the construct. Just that being one needs free. Yeah. Need some new shoulder pads. 
I was expecting him to hang on to the edge. I guess I'm going to give the king a deep burn. He is burning himself. There. I always manage to go the wrong way on pillars like this. Yeah. By the way, tell me, how does it feel to swim in molten metal? Uh, it's pretty chill. <laughs> Yeah, you weren't expecting that one, huh? No! I was expecting a typical here about a toasty or something. Yeah, and that's why he, <laughs> that's why it specifically is a subversion. Can we smash these? Yes, we can. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is definitely a motor metal but Lava does not look like this at all, and I think many games get lava right. Okay. Um, so, it definitely means that there is something that has broken around here. Probably then, yeah. Or, or this is the uh, slag or something of uh, the, not the, the impurities. But I don't think it's still to put me in here. I, I actually missed that hole there. Also, I'm, just, I'm looking over at OBS right now, and the the frames uh, missed is at zero percent at the moment. That's good. And yeah, actually, the hay has it done in those weird stuttering things. It had some had some pixelation, but that's due to my internet. But the one, yeah, what I have seen on the other screen where you get your character is basically vibrating about. Not at all. Okay. That that might be because we, we turned the V-Sync on. There's, there's still some frames missing, but it's only 82 compared to half a million frames. So... Early nothing then. That horseman, I'll get it. Let's put this stone to good use. Let's get this back to the Guardian. Okay. And that one down. You know what? <laughs> Don't rush there. Okay, but I doubt that he'll be able to defend himself like this. So let's hope this doesn't get turned into too much of an escort mission. Uh, should we expect that? Oh. Uh, He's just smashing them with the stone itself. <laughs> yeah, Thane is saying, take this escort mission and shove it up your ass. I just quickly knew that people usually are most fan of this. I think that some games that have gone escort mission good. Well, it's usually done bad. Yeah. Um. I think I remember something with one of the games that we've done or something. Uh, oh. But I'm drawing a blank. It, basically, the escort missions are more tolerable if you're the ones you are escorting are actually being clever about it. Uh, oh, now I, rem now I remember. Uh, singularity. Uh, at some point we had to, yeah, we had to lead or protect uh, one of the scientists around, and he would actually take cover and not move before we clear stuff out. Oh yeah! 
damage off, I think. Or was that? Yeah, it was damage off, I think. Possible. So if we can put this on the list, then well, there won't be a lot of scorpions and the here. And was it damage off? Or was he the enemy? I have forgotten what it is this time. Yeah. Like, Russian names can get... Uh, Russian names can get uh, mixed together over time. Yeah, like some, some names are easy to remember, like... Dimitri, Boris, Ivar... But when, yeah, all, when, when all of their names seem to end on off... Paul or Sky... That, that one that uh, maybe I don't think all of them end with all the sky button, but there are many typical ones that do in the media. Okay. Uh, one of their names was Damage Chair, but I don't remember the other one. I you never know think about I think Demichev was the villain. Oh wait, but wait, what is something like Baris Long? Okay. Baris Long being the one to the head? That's the that the pick other one? Mm, yeah, I'm I'm drawing a complete blank now on which he was. Uh, I, I think Barish Long is the one with the glasses. Yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure you have the name wrong there. I think, uh, I think it is something with a B. Might as well do a quick look then. Let him drop. Okay. I've got your idea. Hop aboard. Oh, you jump like a lass. Again, don't like, don't let uh, the current forge master hear that. Or it's your ass in the blade next time. <laughs> and he even has some water. I, mean, I think it's supposed to be in a lot of the places as well. Yeah, these p the pipe works seem to be pretty busted. <laughs> Unless the, the other thing is supposed to be more the metal and lava, then they do use lava as a way to force the family. Probably to get enough food. Yeah. But still then, the lava pipe works may have gotten broken as well. Okay. Now we're up to level 11 enemies. And actually, we have a skill point to use still. Ooh. That's, uh, that's a lot more defense, so let's grab that. And um, let's not. Let's see. Well, <laughs> we have five skill points. Uh, oh. Let's see. Unstoppable. Deaths on earthly strength is increased for a short while. Strength increases strength by 30. Okay, you still don't actually know what uh, it really does, that, uh, or how much, how strong of an effect it has. Uh, Reaping increases the chance of scoring a critical hits on enemies struck by harvest. Over here we have the ghouls. But also, it is murder. A murderer Crovis emerges from the ether called by death to attack his foes. Flocks deal six damage, summon one flock. Okay. Let's first upgrade this, though, so we can steal more health. And fury generation is increased. Hmm. Okay. 
Mm. Let's put this one in as well. Just so we have a bunch of elements with this attack as well. It increases critical hit chance. Mm, no thanks. Let's see. Hitting enemies with teleport slash also causes an explosion, damaging nearby enemies. But, uh, hmm. And what is this one here? Vegas Guard. Death surrounds himself with a necromantic shield, significantly increasing his defense and resistance. Okay, let's get that one. Ooh. But, uh, increases arcane. Arcane probably does increase our <clears throat> our magic damage, but we're not sure of that yet. So for now, let's see. Next level. Only so only steal two uh, ghouls. Do I have anything we can look up to understand these things a bit better? But I do see um, a question mark. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, oh no, those are those are statistics. Okay. Oh. Hmm. It it might have popped up at the bottom of the screen at some point, but yeah, let's let's put the last point there. Then we need to figure out what button it was again to actually add. There we go. This one can be on Did I put it on the No, uh, let's see. We have X I B Oh I was holding the wrong button. Okay. okay. Doesn't last too long, but should be enough to help us tank a few good hits when faced with bosses. Oh, I already see what's going to go on here. Put that across here. And we just get off. I said get off. And then we're going to raise the platforms. That way, so that way. Can we still reach that now, though? Mm, so let's put it around here. Can we still reach? Oh, oh it's just going to sink down, huh? Alright. Put this as high as we can. Get as much time as we need. And yeah, I, that would, I was being ambitious with that jump. Oh dear. Not seeing anything we can grab onto. Okay, this one is going to be annoying. could have gotten on still even with it lower than that uh, yeah we got we got past that's all that really counts hmm? and you broke another door uh, the, I don't think death will really care much Is 
there any way we could actually climb back up? Over there, probably. Nothing hidden underwater. This game is just love to do that. Does it look like it. Hmm? No fish! Yeah, if there were any fish, the corruption probably would have killed them by now. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder if there would be any hostile of water mobs here in the game in general with this. I think it has accidentally used ability. These things are just going to stay annoying. For some reason, Death just refuses to pluck them out of the sky like War did. Or refuses to do that consistently. Okay. This leads back to the main chamber. Yes, it does. There doesn't seem to be anything of use here. Okay. Oh, wait. It's the entrance. And I see something we used to shame the thing on. Yeah, this, this is the way we got into this place. I think. Hmm. There's another okay. pipe here. No, it's not how we got in. Hmm. Did you see the medallion? Yeah, I saw it. Let's see. Okay, this is the way we got in. Uh, why is there a way to jump back then? I think this is how we got in because we had to go around to get access no, to open up the doors for Thane. So yeah, we we found a way back here. And I think okay, that was that way was probably just to get that uh, medallion then. Or no, we can also climb up here. Okay, now I'm starting to get confused. I don't remember seeing that on the way in. I'm confused as well. As this is probably the way to get back over there. Yeah, Thane is waiting on the other side, so he will hold the door open for us. And this is where the water should be flowing, I think. <gasps> So I think I'd said that I tried uh, streaming without my glasses today, but yeah, I forgot <laughs> if I did say that. Oop. My ears are starting to get a bit annoyed. I'm ready. My... Okay, what other way do we have to go here? Thane can follow us now. But this just goes back through that chamber. Wait, hold on. What, what, what are you calling him? Thane. That's Korn. <laughs> Where the hell did I get Thane from then? The other guy with the axe. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, uh, yeah, so, yeah, I've been... <laughs> I've been calling him the wrong name the entire time. 
Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And now I realized it was him you calling Kane. I thought you spoke about Kane on occasion. But now I realized, wait. Has he mixed up the people again? Yeah. <laughs> Karn. Okay, what watch me make the mistake yet again somehow. And also we need to get the golem over there. Smash up the crystals. So we can take a break from leaning over all the time and just roll out. Um you're always leaning over. Okay, just dust flying overhead for a second. Okay. How much of the stuff are we the going to do? I need to find myself another rider. Yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> and there's the next stone. this do? Okay, we can't use it yet because combat. Okay. So let's just leave Karn to do that for the moment. And okay, we still can't use this one probably because they're still fighting over there. I'm no, just trying to break it up. I'm trying to press that thing to fly away higher or further away. Knock, knock. And I'm also gonna get that. Yep, completely missed that one. Okay, is that the last? I'll take care of this. Really? <laughs> I think it's pretty clear who can protect who better at the moment with this. Alright. Fuck <laughs> this thing. Wait, is that a crusher? <clears throat> Pardon? Let's see. Come on, why can't I use that thing? Is this is this one too close? And there's some crystals that can be smashed there. Or is that the way we got in? No it it Seems we just can't interact with this one. Or is it already in the on position or something? Okay, that is how we got in. There's the health potion. It's... Okay, we're... Yeah, we're just going to have to swing. Over there, there's more, anything hidden. I see something there. Yep. Okay. We've got quite a lot of them out now. <laughs> I think Voldemort pays like 500 for each. See when we find him again. Okay. Yeah, this thing obviously should be running, and well, clearly it isn't. Okay. 
going and the music's gone. Okay, should that be a point of worry? Here it comes again. Bunch of prowlers. Easy slaughter. Anything up here? Before I jump down. I need to jump down. Okay, still need to jump down. <laughs> At least we got some parts covered. And yet again. Any goodies? Yep, still. Okay, we, we better hope that one of these pipes isn't the sewage. <laughs> yeah. I'm not really sure if pure purity of water would be mu of much of a, an issue with when uh, you're foraging something. And again, impurities in the water might uh, attach to the steel as it's cooling or something like that. Like if it's in the house, like it's in the house, and you make polluted water, you probably don't want to quench it all in it. So yeah, if you're forging in something, don't quench it in super water. Unless you're trying to make some sort of toxic blade or something. Okay, now the water's flowing and we can get out again. Mm. Oh, okay. The bombs have been growing on the bottom. <laughs> the pulgrims. And, yeah, that very much is a crusher. Okay, so that's what... That is what the uh, lever is for. The question is, though, what are we going to have to crush then? That looks weird. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what the hell? What is what? Oh! It's one of the dozen things that we've been using already. <gasps> okay, where is our exit here? by clinging on to one of the cold ones or something. If that is even the correct term. Boy. We have to put this thing through the pressure. What? Uh, yeah, why would be why would hmm. let's just see if it even allows us to that answers why somewhat still why do we need the ball and not the entire thing or is that just for getting up here no, no we that's what we have corn for 
Okay, again the question becomes why do we need to do that? I'm pretty sure this was already open enough. But there's a door over there. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we should have been able to do that already, even without I'm smashing the golem. Unless the ball is for something over. Maybe we'll have to see. Oh, hello there. It's only very interested in our pop. We need it here. The golem wouldn't have fit through the door. Okay. We were probably meant to find that out in the opposite way. Hmm. Okay, let's get this thing over there. I'm <laughs> playing with the biggest hamster ball. This is horrible. After all you can do with the golem, you just betray him? Almost in. Awesome. But, yeah, but I guess it needed to be done. Prince of Persia stuff. There we go. What do we find up here? Okay, it's just directly to the stone. Then we can get back and then we'll have to find the last one. Wait, I think the football did in something. And that is? Corb. Yeah, he's still downstairs, so he can come running up. Okay, that's running. Running. Uh, okay. this one running. I'm surprised he's not louder. Hmm? I'm surprised he's not louder in running. Must be a lot of padding in those boots then. And Nightmare Crawler. Okay, let's give this thing nightmares of its own then. That was quick. I'm not sure a soul stone or a heart stone counts as a hammer. Okay. Don't really think it had much of an effect on anything else, but yeah, the water is higher now. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, we're, we'll need to go around again to open up the gate so we can pass through. be one more and then we'll finally have that stupid <laughs> then we'll finally have a big giant golem to go <laughs> fight the evil eyeball with. I wonder 
Peter, will you be able to finish the boss fight before we end the stream? Now we have some 25 minutes left. So I, I think we'll be able to finish the dungeon, but not the uh, big eye. Okay, I'm running through you. Is the, no, does this game feel bigger than the last one? Mm. Yeah, it is bi a lot bigger in scale, at least. We have been skipping some of the moving around by fast traveling. But yeah, I think this very first area is already bigger than like two or three areas of Darksiders 1. Yeah, and uh, in the last oh, okay. we basically did one boss per episode the almost. The stone, yeah. Like blood flows. Well, well done, one dungeon and boss. Okay, and we, because we got the water flowing, we, well, <clears throat> we, what would be the words? Hardened up all of the lava, cool it down at least. Okay, we've got a golem, but... Okay, this is one, this one is simple, just open it up. No airlock to deal with. This one might be short. Okay. Just up here. That's the final story. I hope and oh. That does not look good. You sure you want to use this one, Karn? Is that a screen the crystals are letting out once they are smashed? No, it's just chattering sounds. Still, I, I think we might want to put this hard stone for the power washer first. On your power washer is the right method. <laughs> Purify it, at least. Cannot hit those. Hmm. Yeah, I think even Karn notices something is amiss because he's keeping his distance. <laughs> Seems a bit like yeah. there's a pillar missing here. I feel like since those wood pillars are here, there's definitely not supposed to be lava here. Uh, yeah, look at that. that. That pipe is busted. More than just busted, it's completely shattered. Where do we need to jump to from here? Do we need to. Alright, look like they are meant to throw the lava around or heating the fortress, but yeah. Oh, the corruption probably broke a few pipes. Or, well, many pipes. Yeah, practically all of them. Yeah, I do like that oftentimes in games when you get the grappling hook, it's used for one thing and one thing only, but here we can use it to extend. Our parkour as well. Oh yeah, I kind of like that. There's something wrong with this one. Yeah, I think that's a bit obvious. Oh. Yeah, 
to deal with this one, and I kind of forgot we had that with it and not the pistol. <laughs> we could just latch on it and spread up spread like a fly. Now we know what it was going to fall. Ow. Immediately using a health potion. We're kind of lacking a pressure to do the easy work this time. Ow. Maybe it is a good idea to get rid of these things afterwards then. then. Did I? I think I have it a bit... I had it a bit stunned luck there for a moment. I couldn't decide which way to turn towards me. Okay, big boy. Come on. Okay, teleport splash is also useful for getting behind an enemy. As long as they are already part way in it. Evade counter. If death makes a particularly skillful dodge of an enemy's attack, a flicker of his reaper form appears to strike back at the attacker. Okay, so a dodge parry. Um, yeah, you still sure you want to put this one in, Karn? That's going to need a lot of soap. Yeah, and we've even got some new items. Yeah, you might as well check them out for... Let's see. Uh, 16 execution there and chance. Let's take those. More, a lot more damage with those. Let's see. For 70, a full 100 damage more. Uh, Still equipping these, if it was critical chance, it would have been a little more useful since, well, you can see that it only has three critical chance to hit. Then again, these things attack very fast. Yeah. Give me the fuck, sir. After you. You sure you want to put that one in? Then again, hopefully two pure heart stones will uh, will uh, counteract this one. And hello there in the chat, Frank Twenty Four. We must place the stone into the hello. garden. We've seen its work, Horseman. Corruption fair weeps from it. The other two heart stones were pure. I'm wagering that their radiance will cleanse the third. Mayhaps. Khan, the greater risk is to do nothing. Hey. Way dust. I'm pretty sure. Isn't this the end? I know that. Hmm. Way is blocked by a door. Yeah, we'll have to go around and open it. 
Uh, this one is still luckily on our side. Though I didn't think this thing will do much against that big boy. <laughs> yeah, but because we basically let out a, a weapon of mass destruction out. Well, that's Elliot. It's not the point to fight the corruption. Yeah. You basically gave the corruption a new weapon. Yeah, we basically pulled Anakin with this. Well, what do we mark it to call it a Kenobi? Since, well, <laughs> the, uh, the Guardian was supposed to destroy the corruption, not join it. left Cornabits just stunned a bit back there. Okay, where did that big motherfucker go? Be careful what you ask about. <laughs> Was that as damage before? Where you didn't actually look back earlier. Uh, you got anything to say about your big brother? We've got a, a very big, <laughs> we've got a very big job to take care of. I want to sleep now. Okay, anyone got any comments here about how big we fucked up? Free time. The Guardians run wild. He's gone mad, horseman. Idar doesn't know. Browse around. We have no yes, yes. Something to say, but not much. And yeah, I look, like I said earlier, the shadows thing is apparently an issue with the engine itself. Let's see. Um, yeah, let's first sell off all our old stuff. Not selling off the big stuff. Oh, this should go nicely with me. Ah, Valis will put it to good use. I'm not selling that. Oh. Yep, okay, that that is almost doubled our cash. Did not expect to get that much from it all. Okay. Uh, stronger. Okay, that's the buyback. No need for that. Let's see. Uh, all of these sites are damage upgrades. Health per kill, 45. Ice damage. Health on execute and health per kill. Uh, let's get these. Thank you, horseman. Not that enough anymore. Thorns, defense. I think. Yeah, let's get these. Oh, that's an excellent investment. Okay, button. Okay, that's a pretty Whoa. gnarly design. It also that's pokes pretty. death less in the shoulders. Show blades and a pretty face as well. Yeah, maybe some... those looked a bit like snakes, so could that that could be a depiction of Medusa, or just the curly hair? Uh, questions. Well, I'm pretty sure that Ayla would uh, want to turn us to stone after this, bro. 
Oh god. Okay, all of this is left intact. Um, okay, she's still here. So... Hmm. We haven't used Reaper modes all that often. Or much at all. So let's see what else she has to say. The has risen all around us. What was old is new again. Okay, one of these should have good defense. Unless she changed out her stuff. Which it seems she has. Okay. She also sells health potions. Yeah. Oh well. As you read, and I get. I think we're going to have to leave it on somewhat of a cliffhanger because we're nearing the two hours. It looks like it. Okay, here. Yes. Yeah, yeah, now we're going to have to deal with two big ass problems here. I, I was expecting we, we need to fight it. Just didn't expect it to be from. Yeah, that. Okay. Didn't expect it to be from out messing it up. Yeah, I guess that goes to show then uh, how how powerful the corruption is. And even one of them can overpower, or one, one corrupted hearthstone can overpower two pure ones. Ooh. He's going to be he was going to be his cross there. Okay, now how do we deal with you, big boy? No, the town is going to be moving at that temple for me. Going to be able to need get this thing. We have eight Ow. Okay, so he's just going. Ooh. Okay, so that's how we get into this with the. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yep. Run, run, run. Did it mean the other? Did Basically, yeah. Okay, uh, there. Yes, clear. Uh, wait, where was it? Out there. Can't switch to the correct one. Okay, yeah, we we are going to take this guy out one at a time, one part at a time. 
Next. But yeah, this is very much like Shadow of the Colossus. Okay, come on, take a swing, big boy. Yep, move it away, move it away. Ow. How did I... That's going to be annoying that we're going to have to be switching between these. Yeah, too high up for us to reach. Let's not leave it at a cliffhanger. Oh, come on, he's just seriously bounce off. Of I'm walking. Okay. Um, just, there we go. One down, two to go. And yeah, let's extend the stream a bit and... Oh, hello. Okay, so they gave this thing not only a hammer, but also an arm cannon. Okay. Keep following me, roly-poly. Um, okay, smart enough not to head straight for its owner. I think we need to guide that thing back to it. Okay, it just blew up on its own. That was a very good one. The big bad eye. I think it's specifically rolling around, not trying to hit it. Yeah, it's not following us that well. Oh, uh, but the. Uh, Okay. So we know that now. We have to shoot it, but then it starts. It's gonna shoot straight at us. Yeah, yeah, shut up, big boy. Throw it another of your bowling balls. Time to run out of ammo. Okay, now we get between it. Yeah, come on, come on. Okay. And now we can climb up here, okay. Send the spear off. Sure, but I think it's easy to guess that uh, the developers had a Shadow of the Colossus fan amongst them.
And there we go, <laughs> right as we hit two hours and one minute. <laughs> uh, exactly as <laughs> the timer goes off as well, which I had set to two hours and a minute, to take into account the uh, intro bit. <laughs> the Dark Talons. A dead lord loyal to the deposed king, Argyll, forced these claws from the heart of a glacier. When Argyll was overthrown, many of his lieutenants were destroyed, and the Dark Talons were thought to have lost forever. These weapons seethe with the essence of deep winter cold, and every strike freely praises the blood of its victims. Those enemies that the claws freeze into immobility are even more vulnerable to its touch, suffering horrendous wounds from any follow-up attacks. Okay. You had no choice but to destroy him, horseman. Yet if the path to the Tree of Life is to be cleared, I have no choice but to bring him back. How many times would you have me kill him? The Guardian will be as a newborn, free of corruption. Now, stand aside. This will take more than a small effort. <laughs> Maker. That task defines my very purpose, as the reaping of souls defines your own. There is no escaping it! to the tree now, horseman. Your journey is far from over. And there we have it. Achievement, Heart of the Mountain, and Dust to Dust. Oh, a, a gift. A, okay. <laughs> of course, that was unexpected. But yeah, that's the first world's boss done. What the heck? And that's also where we'll have to leave it off for today, though. So, let's save. And... yeah. You can say one thing for certain about this game, it gets freaking epic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I, I'm not gonna argue against that. And I, I just love that it... <laughs> It kills the corruption core by headbutting it. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, to continue, we'll have to wait until next week. So for now, though, uh, thank you for watching Frank24, even though you've taken off for whatever reason, doesn't really matter too much. Thank you all the same. And thank you for anyone else who has been watching now or later. And you, as especially as always, Drakir. Oh, you're most welcome, as always, my dear old friend. And, yeah. Oh, I only now notice that there's a skull atop there, written in his scar. 
but hmm. uh, yeah next week tuesday we'll be continuing where we're at this game saturday more orcs must die and sunday it'll be the usual and once again death is proving to be a bit of a masochist and poking himself with his own sights <laughs> oh. yeah. but yeah as always, thanks again, and until next time, but until then, have a nice day, and until then, be safe, folks!